All right. We are going to fight Bowser, it looks like. Baby Bowser. Well, we literally just brought it with us. Yep, here's an obvious trap. Mm. Scree hee hee! Thanks for going to all the trouble to gather these for us! At last, he has succeeded. His pushiness will finally see his dreams fulfilled. Ah yes, all of our tribulations have been worth this fated day. Finally we got them all! Hurry up! I want to make my dream happen! Of course you're stumping this! Make a wish! Whatever your stinky little heart desires! I want the biggest, baddest, most awesomest robot! Way more awesome robots than this. The great King Bowser. I've seen greater King Bowsers than that. supposed to hit him and then hit him once more so that's satisfying sadly I'm all out of eggs Oh, he's trying to bounce a little thing at me, you little punk. Great, let's survive with that full health bonus. Just kidding, that doesn't matter for boss fights, luckily. Oh, didn't see that coming. Okay, you can't touch those at all, but you can stand on them. Ouch. Yeah, big deal. Yeah, 
don't hit the rockets by accident. Problem is, uh, I don't have a way to actually damage him. That sucks. Now I do. Okay, good. I'm glad he didn't go in. We're still getting health, so it's clearly not the end of the fight. What have you done to his petulance? Worry not, I will help you! Okay, now we're gonna have Big Baby Bowser. Because every Yoshi game except Yoshi's story has to end with Big Baby Bowser. Sun Dreamstone, grant his impishness even more strength! Oh my! Oh my! I may have ever done it! Of course. <laughs> it's over 9,000. <laughs> it's probably meant to be a reference. Mega Baby Bowser again. One hit to just let myself die and get it over with just so I can restart. I hope this phase of the fight is a checkpoint. Really mean if this wasn't a checkpoint. Yikes. That was scary. Kind of tricked me there. Oh wait! I actually I actually uh, have these throws ammunition. And that's why these little things are glowing. But, I guess... Oh, there's... Now there's switches! Should've probably eaten the eggs first. Uh, okay, that... This is like his HP bar or something. So I, I don't have to get the hammers again. I guess I can just hit him whenever I want, unless he actually destroys the hammers. Just keep wailing on him! Okay, so all you have to do is just keep wailing on him afterward. Okay, now he's just... now he's just sending meteors at us. Yikes! What's the point in shooting these fireballs in three directions? It's a 2D game, you know. Those fireballs won't even get close to me. Yeah, that's actually really epic. I probably should have waited out another shooting star phase just so I can get more hammers, because now I'm just... I guess it doesn't matter either way. 
It's gonna take the same amount of hammers to hit him regardless, I bet. At least those meteors just don't have a blast radius. Yikes! Okay! Now you're changing things up, baby. Okay, where are those things gonna fall? Alright, this should be pretty epic. Okay. Yep, that's what I thought you were gonna do. But that's it. Okay, I'll take that. Oh! You little punk, you tricked me! Good thing we had two of these. Oh, is that, is that it? Is that all we had to do? So this, it's these two rounds, basically. is still better. So the Sun Dream Sun was finally restored. And the Yoshis grew happier. Together the Yoshis dreamed, I'm gonna be dreaming in a few minutes, that they could be returned to their island home. Let's head back home. And that is the exciting conclusion of Yoshi's Crafted World. So, like I was saying, it's a good game. It's pretty fun. It's got some nice variety in the levels. I, I say it is... I think it is better than Yoshi's Wooly World, just because of the special objectives. It made, um... It made it a lot more fun to track things down. And it's really fun to... I like this... The whole two point... The whole 3D perspective thing, how you can hit things in the background. It, it was fun to, It was fun to play around with my sniping skills. I, I especially like the mini games that involve sniping. Those are really... Those are really epic. Overall, that is definitely one of Nintendo's uh, side projects. For a Mario platform game, not really a Mario game, it's a Yoshi game. They're a completely different genre. I'm sure not many people will find this memorable, and I'll probably for 
I'll probably forget about it in a few months or so. Well, I feel like this is a lot more memorable than you, Wooly World. Like, I remember nothing from Wooly World. Except the, the, the bonus level music was pretty epic. I remember this one level with the, uh, where you had to ride the, uh, the, the Sky Bill. I think that was a cool level, but it probably annoyed me. And I it also had a giant baby Bowser fight. So I guess as you're scrolling through all these levels again, you're going to see the special targets. Like, I see that lion. I don't see the shy guy. Well, I guess not all the special targets. Probably the most distinct ones. Did you ever have to hit that Yoshi rock? I'm pretty sure that was like the thing you had to... No, no, it's not the thing you had to go around. You probably had to hit that Yoshi rock. It looks like something that'd be important to hit. <laughs> See, this part of the music here, and it's been in other levels too, it sounds like part of the Smash Ultimate theme, like... Da, 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 da. Everyone's born from the battle. However that song goes, but... See, right now it's doing it. See, this is the Smash Ultimate theme. It's a super gentle remix. I've also been watching Bayonetta, so I guess now I'll be able to play as Bayonetta and Smash. References. The Yoshis were finally returned home to their peaceful island. And they lived happily ever after until Mario was born. Then they kept getting sacrificed. <laughs> Thank you for saying. Yoshi's story is still the hardest Yoshi game, I think, just because how tricky it is. Good feel. Who the hell are good feel? Just because how tricky it is to get everything. The Hidden Hills appeared! Uh you have unlocked boss challenges. Uh oh my god, so now the bosses actually have challenges. Oh, this sucks. So the hidden hills, I guess that's the super hard Is it Is it a bonus level or is it actually a whole new area? This is a whole area! Oh, this is gonna suck. <laughs> might, might actually be pretty cool, but you know. So I guess this is how I can view the credits again. Like, we don't want to do that. Hiya, you're Yoshi, yeah? We oui, thought so. I'm Sprout Blockefeller. Wanna play some hide and seek? I'll go hide in some place now, so you can find me, okay? Okay, off I go. Oh no! So I was gonna hit some of the cores, find him and toss an egg in him. Oh, you're kidding me! So now we really will have to play the. Now we're gonna have to play every level again! <laughs> I don't wanna do this. By some of the courses, you mean all the courses. Because why would it just be a few random courses? Ugh. I don't- I really don't want to. What? Okay, so the bosses legit had challenges now. Why couldn't they have this available before? Clear without taking damage. Clear the time limit. Attack a magnet when the boss is- Attach a magnet when the boss's face is red. So I guess, so along the, uh, the usual challenges, there's like special challenges, or is that magnet thing in every boss? Break two or more IVs. Ugh, I really, I really don't want to. Well, I guess I'm not getting 100% because I just really don't feel like doing that. I don't feel like, I don't feel like playing every level again just to find 
Blockfeller Jr. We're just gonna check out, uh, this place. Oh, there's even a thing here, too. Guess we'll check out the first special level. So you're basically gonna... Hopefully you don't need all the smiley flowers, because then I'm gonna be forced to do all those other missions. Well... Hopefully I'll be able to check out each of these special levels without having to do those other missions. Screw that. So the gimmick is basically... whoa. We're off to a great start, aren't we? The gimmick is basically these spinny flowers. Given the nature of these levels... Okay, that that little hangy thing right there, that is going to be a secret objective. Of course, there'll be secret objectives in this place. Flower number one. So given the nature of these levels, we're probably going to not want to get hit once. Because there's not going to be much help to help us. Wow, that sucked. Oh my god, that sucks! You're, um, you're kind of a flower, aren't you? Them's my epic sniping skills, baby. Here's my epic dying skills, baby. Well, might as well scout out this next area, shall we? So... You can't die once, is what you're saying. Well, strap in, fellas. We're gonna... We're gonna spend the rest of our lives here, and I do not feel like doing it tonight.